Ieta for telling my wife I don't care about her dreams? My wife wants to be an influencer on TikTok and YouTube. She has been creating mommy content and content about her day-to-day -day life. When she told me this is something she wanted to do I didn't have a problem with I only said that I don't want our children, 4 meters, 2f, in any of her content. I didn't monitor her channel because it didn't really seem necessary. I recently watched her channel because I thought it'd be cute so see what she does in her day-to-day -day life. I found our children faces in almost all of her content. I told her straight up she needs to remove all of her content. She said that she knew I wouldn't agree but she doesn't think this is a big deal. I don't like children content. I feel like a lot of the time when you see that children make profit they become less of your kids and more of a product and your interactions become more performative and I can see the same thing has happened in her because she posted a video of her getting our two year old out of a tantrum and how she deals with it but how is your first instinct to record and hold a camera whilst our baby is crying. She started crying saying that she built this up and this is her dream and deleting her content will ruin it and I said I simply don't give a fuck, if you don't delete it I will consider a divorce. I know a lot of people have children on their social media and I don't mind an Instagram or Facebook post but to make videos seem to intimate to share. She told her friends and even hinted on her social media accounts that she has an over-controlling and narcissistic husband that doesn't want her on social media. I'm currently being ridiculed by her friends. Am I being over-controlling or narcissistic? Edit someone asked what kind of content. The content isn't really harmful just her feeding them and playing with them but the two types of videos I have problems with is her recording our children tantrums and our two-year-old still doesn't like clothes. We are trying to get her to wear them more but our house can be hot so she is in diaper a lot. I don't like the videos of our daughter in her diapers. NTA people who make profits from their kids' misery are the Oz here. And it seems like your wife is more interested in being a TikTok celebrity than being a caring wife and mother. No one should ever be shilling out their kids for likes and imaginary internet points. NTA monetizing children is fucking gross. You can have a successful mommy channel without exploiting those you are meant to protect and claim to love. She has an over-controlling and narcissistic husband talk to a lawyer. Your kids are not props. NTA. NTA problems are starting to arise already and she's not even viral yet I presumed. I would get an attorney over this because she's putting her wannabe influencer lifestyle ahead of her family's welfare. Going against you and doing this behind your back will not end well if you don't put your foot down. My kids are always going to be my first priority, but my wife life revolve around our children and her phone. She spends most of her free time with her phone because she couldn't maintain her friends and her family live away. I have tried to encourage hobbies or like a yoga class or something but she declines or gives up after one try. Vlogging has been the only thing she been consistent with. I think maybe if she takes a break from her phone and seek therapy and better hobbies she will be fine but at the moment I think she only sees me as an over-controlling husband and her friends are trying to convince her to leave based on what she told them so I don't know how to help her. At the moment I feel like a divorce is my only option but if we get a divorce wouldn't she be free to still make content. I'm confused on how to deal with this issue. A business model that is built on exploiting your own kids is both ethically dodgy now and building up problems for your future relationship with your kids. That dream sounds more like a nightmare. If she's going to conduct her arguments with you via her social media, then she's told you just about everything you need to know. I'm pretty sure YouTube removes content with kids if they're told it's without parental consent. NTA Absolutely NTA children are taken advantage of all the time by TikTok and influencers. Kids have no idea what social media is. They can't consent to being online forever. Not to mention the amount of weirdos out there. It's been proven that videos with kids get watched and saved more. Especially when they are in revealing clothing. Protect your kids. NTA. She can be a content creator without kids in the videos. There are plenty of things to do. She can still do mommy content without the kids. Packing their lunches. How she gets ready. Meal prep. Just talking about how she handles discipline. Etc. You are the other parent and have a right to say no to them being an influencer content. As for the question of are you generally narcissistic and controlling. I don't have enough info. How often do you threaten divorce? Are you controlling in other ways? It kinda sounds like this is bigger than Aida. Your wife might be struggling in her role as a mom if she's this latched onto being a mommy influencer. I would look into that.
I have never threatened divorce before but then again we have only been married for a little over a year. I am not controlling. She has access to all our money and has the freedom to go out. I have even been trying to get her to go make actual in-person friends. We also live close to my sister and mom who are genuinely happy to take our kids at any time and have a regular deep cleaner who helps when me and her are overwhelmed. Bro maybe fix her having access to all your money right away. Because she has the legal right to drain your bank accounts and you can do nothing about it presently. Not smart to lash out and threaten divorce on someone who can take you to the cleaners. She probably needs therapy. It's not TikTok per se. It's the compulsion for attention and approval. Something is missing and she's turning to ethically dodgy means to fill a void. Maybe depression or identity issues. Maybe starved for approval during her own childhood. Influencers are garbage. People who want to be influencers are on their way to being just as bad. The fact that your wife included your children in her content after you specifically made that a boundary is a major problem. Your wife is never going to be an influencer. What she will end up being is a neglectful, abusive parent. Your children will never have privacy when it comes to her influencer aspirations. NTA. It really wasn't a sole decision we actually came to that conclusion together. I don't know what made her change her mind about showing their faces. NTA. That kind of exploitative content is pretty gross to watch, NGL. Every single aspect of her parenthood is only a facade for the sake of putting it on the internet. She's also including her kids in a life they may not even want what is she going to do if she actually succeeds at becoming an influencer and her kids are recognized and hounded at school. Haha, <laughs> hey Timmy. Those were some pretty rad Star Wars sheets you pissed in when you were four my mom loved your mom's tips on getting stains out. Though, people who put their kids all over everything are never careful enough. You made one request, and she dismissed it entirely. What she's doing is disrespectful and, quite frankly, could be dangerous. There are sick people out there and she's just turning your kids into easily identifiable targets. NTA. You are protecting your children, not controlling your wife. Like you said her first priority is making a video of what she does as opposed to actually taking care of her children. Also, she said she knew you wouldn't agree to having the kids in the videos but did it anyway in other words she lied to your face. She can cry all she wants about you, crushing her dreams, but before that, she intentionally deceived you. Knowing that she had no intention of doing what she promised you she would do. No, who is really being narcissistic. NTA based on the whole narcissistic shade that is being thrown at you. It's clear she's been sucked into a whirlpool of social media. It's up to you to pull her out or give up. NTA. I suggest talking with a lawyer and screenshotting all the comments she has made. I don't get this mania of parents using their kids for content. How will those kids feel when they grow up and are known for the stupid shit they did when they were little? Not to mention that this opens the door to predators. She can have a mommy blog without her children being shown. I'm with everyone else. NTA. But serious curiosity. If Op were to divorce her, is there anything legally that could stop her from posting the children since she won't have Op there to potentially stop it? Sounds like she'll do it no matter what. So alarming. I bet it could be written into the divorce settlement, custody agreement. I'm currently being ridiculed by her friends. And hopefully you don't give a flying F in a rolling donut what her friends think. Those family influencers are the worst. The worst. NTA.